Hello everyone. Welcome to UIAS. Let's discuss today's prelims topics. Question 1 Consider the following statements about lymphatic filariasis, LF. 1. India is committed to eliminating lymphatic filariasis by 2027, three years ahead of the global target. 2. Is a parasitic disease caused by three species of microscopic, thread-like worms transmitted to humans through flies. 3. Lymphatic filariasis impairs the lymphatic system and can lead to the abnormal enlargement of body parts, causing pain, severe disability, and social stigma. Which of the following given above is are correct? A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 and 3 only. C. 1, 2 and 3. D. 2 and 3 only. Answer is B. Lymphatic filariasis is a parasitic disease caused by three species of microscopic, thread-like worms. The adult worms only live in the human lymph system. The lymph system maintains the body's fluid balance and fights infections. Lymphatic filariasis affects over 120 million people in 72 countries throughout the tropics and subtropics of Asia, Africa, the Western Pacific, and parts of the Caribbean and South America. Lymphatic filariasis, commonly known as elephantiasis, is a neglected tropical disease. Infection occurs when filarial parasites are transmitted to humans through mosquitoes. Infection is usually acquired in childhood causing hidden damage to the lymphatic system. The painful and profoundly disfiguring visible manifestations of the disease, lymphedema, elephantiasis and scrotal swelling occur later in life and can lead to permanent disability. These patients are not only physically disabled, but suffer mental, social and financial losses contributing to stigma and poverty. In 2020, 863 million people in 50 countries were living in areas that require preventive chemotherapy to stop the spread of infection. Question to consider the following statements about xenobots. 1. It's a first living robot. 2. They are less than a millimeter long, were created in 2020 from the stem cells of the African bats. 3. They can be programmed using artificial intelligence. Which of the following given above is are correct? A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 and 3 only. C. 1, 2 and 3. D. 2 only. Answer is B. Xenobots, which are less than a millimeter long, were created in 2020 from the stem cells of the African clawed frog and can be programmed using artificial intelligence. When the researchers put the xenobots into a petri dish, they were able to gather hundreds of tiny stem cells inside their mouths and create new xenobots a few days later. Once perfected, xenobots could be useful for tasks like cleaning up microplastics and regrowing or replacing dead cells and tissues inside human bodies. Question 3 with reference to industrial revolutions, IR, consider the following statements. 1. The first IR used water and steam power to mechanize production, 1800s. 2. The second IR used electric power to create mass production, early 1900s. 3. The third IR which is building on the second revolution has data at its core. Which of the following given above is are correct? A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 only. C. 1, 2 and 3. D. 2 and 3 only. Answer is A. The first industrial revolution used water and steam power to mechanize production, 1800s. The second used electric power to create mass production, early 1900s. The third used electronics and information technology to automate production, late 1900s. The 4IR, which is building on the third revolution, has data at its core. The term 4IR was coined by Klaus Schwab, 
एग्जीक्यूटिव चेयरपर्सन ऑफ द वर्ल्ड इकोनॉमिक फोरम डब्ल्यू एफ इन टू थाउजेंड एंड सिक्सटीन वेन ही डिस्क्राइब इट एज एन इंडस्ट्रियल रेवोल्यूशन दैट डज नॉट चेंज वॉट वी आर डूइंग बट चेंजेस अस ever since the concept has divided the world over its utility and its impact on our future on the one hand a group of technologists who call themselves futurists claim that artificial intelligence and other associated technologies will enhance human beings in the future question 4 with reference to solitary waves consider the following statements one they directly control particle energization plasma loss transport etc through wave particle interactions two solitary waves are the distinct electric field fluctuations bipolar or monopolar that follow constant amplitude phase relations three their shape and size are highly affected during their propagation which of the following given above is our correct a one and two only b one and three only C 1 2 and 3 D 3 only Answer is A Solitary waves are the distinct electric field fluctuations bipolar or monopolar that follow constant amplitude phase relations Their shape and size are less affected during their propagation The magnitude and duration of these pulses are found to be 1 to 25 millivolt meter and 0.2 to 1.7 milliseconds respectively. These pulses are dominantly seen in the dawn and afternoon dusk sectors at an altitude of 1000 to 3500 kilometers around the Mars. The dominant occurrence of solitary waves in the dawn and dusk sector is still a mystery and needs further investigation. Through simulations, it is found that the spatial extent of these structures is very small, 30 to 330 meters. As these waves are known to be responsible for the plasma energization and its transport in Earth's magnetosphere, The team is further exploring their role in the particle dynamics in the Martian magnetosphere and whether such waves play any role in the loss of atmospheric ions on the Mars. Question 5 consider the following statements. 1 our earth is a giant magnet and its magnetic field protects us from high speed charged particles that are continuously emitted from the sun in the form of solar wind. 2 unlike earth The planet Mars do not have any intrinsic magnetic field and allows the high speed solar wind to interact directly with the Mars atmosphere like an obstacle in flow. 3 even in a weak and thin magnetosphere as that of the Mars one can observe frequent occurrences of solitary waves. Which of the following given above is our correct? A 1 only B 1 and 3 only C 1 2 and 3 D 2 and 3 only Answer is C Our earth is a giant magnet and its magnetic field protects us from high speed charged particles that are continuously emitted from the sun in the form of solar wind Unlike earth the planet Mars do not have any intrinsic magnetic field This allows the high speed solar wind to interact directly with the Mars atmosphere like an obstacle in flow. It has been suggested that even in a weak and thin magnetosphere as that of the Mars, one can observe frequent occurrences of solitary waves. However, despite several missions to Mars, the presence of solitary waves in the Martian magnetosphere has never been reported earlier. Thank you everyone. Do subscribe this channel. Use code SPLIVE to join an academy.